Konye Joshua is not seeing the ambition of becoming the most senior person from the southeast in the House of Representatives is the one that is using a phantom AA candidate in a desperate bid to usurp rules in the House of Representatives. She is allegedly banking on using pliant judges at the Court of Appeal to seal her tribunal victory and then march on to become a ranking APC member from the southeast to actualize her goals which will no doubt conflict with the existing equilibrium. For a proof that she is the one flying these treacherous kids to evidence in the paid protesters, she has mobilized to urge her to resign as a minister and return to the House of Representatives. Nkiru Konye Georgia is desperate to the point that one North Central Amazons for Bola Ahmed Tinubu Nkabat is among the groups asking her to abandon her ministerial role and return to the House of Representatives. Gentlemen of the press, please know that Inkabat, also known as APC Women Group, North Central Zone, is not even from her Isukwato Imunoche federal constituency. This could only mean that she is not acceptable enough in her constituency to secure the support of home-based groups to plead for her return to the National Assembly, or that she is already performing so dismally as a minister to the extent that a North Central Group is eager to see her exit the federal cabinet cabinet for a more competent woman. We call on the national chairman of our great party, His Excellency Dr. Omar Ganduje, to draw Nkiru Konye Joshua's attention to how, to how her actions constitute anti-party activities, which therefore requires that she should be excused from her ministerial position, where she is unable to face her ministerial duties while leaving the legislature alone. Our final appeal is to our father, President Mola Abed Tinubu to use the case of Nkiruka Onye Georgia to set an example for members of his cabinet that the National Assembly before them has no room for distractions. If Mr. President allows her to get away with this brigandage, then it is a matter of time before most members of his cabinet pursue destructive personal agendas that will lead to the entire government being distracted. This is something that Nigeria cannot afford at this time. The Concerned APC Women Forum is here by calling on the Minister of State for Labor and Employment, Nkiru Konye Joshua, to face her ministerial duties instead of jumping from one election tribunal to the other in an attempt to procure cut judgments for the purpose of destabilizing the National Assembly and by implicating damaged democracy in Nigeria. We wish to make it clear that she has become a disgrace to women in the country because the so-called agitation for women's inclusion that she is purportedly championing has been respected by Mr. President.